poem, but uh, unfortunately I started reading from another one in the middle of it. Anyway, this one is called Song of the Seaside, and it's based upon my experiences, I guess, when I, in seeing the decline of our seaside towns. I went to school in Ramsgate in Kent, um, and we actually lived in Margate, and my parents owned a hotel, so we were really part of that community. Um, it's called Song of the Seaside. It's not a song, but uh, it's just convenient to call it Song of the Seaside, I guess. Um, I know that um, I broadcast a poem called um, Beside the Seaside, which was actually quite popular, so hopefully this will be as well. Um, let me just get into it. It's nothing very complicated, but it talks about the decline of the seaside towns which wasn't just the Isle of Thanet, it was Hastings, we could go around them all. Very few of them actually sustained the move towards the cheap flights to uh, uh, Spain. Uh, in the 50s, people used to go to Italy, but that was generally by car. Um, and then once in the late 50s and early 60s, people started to go into buy Spain, to Spain by plane, then really that was the end of that glorious period. Okay, Song of the Seaside. Breaking seas on promenade walls, sounds of silvery seagulls calls, flotsam on the grey-brown beach, sheltering ships beyond the reach of gale-force gusts beneath wintry skies that will the water's waves to rise. The sailors on brave battered boats glimpse grey-green where the jetsam floats, Deliver to diverse destinations, produce to ports from unknown station, nations. Unseen cargoes, dark days and nights, witnessed by the vessel's lights. Couples stride along the strand, hardy souls, dogs leads in hand. Clothed in coat and hood or hat, no trace remains where children sat. Their hounds run free along the sands, no ice cream vendors nor military bands. Winter wreaks its weather well, aspects altered by the ocean swell. This seems to be a different place, as if humans here were a different race. Lovers of air, the fresh and pure, taking a traditional seaside cure. Birds' nests along the cliff face grow, chalky rocks white as winter snow. From whence other walkers may look down, keeping, keeping close to the grey and ageing town that used to be a beauty blessed to Londoners taking a well-earned rest. Now dishevelled shops are closed or grim, where status seekers keep fit and trim, hotels converted to social apartments for the great unwanted, rejected like garments. No more catering to the middle classes, now watering holes for one day passes. As cut price fares fly to foreign seas, those that our seaside sought to please. Here is developed the low-cost town, a seaside contribution to dumbing down, where price of product determines choice and arguments are won by the loudest voice. The beauty of the seaside lost, we may all live to count the cost of short-term planning and speculation, a source of shame to a seafaring nation, even when the sun has day-long shone. The seed sides attraction has all but gone. Thank you very much.